Hey everybody, I'm Matt Bauer with My Computer Works, and welcome to this video in our How My Computer Works series. In this video, I want to show you how you can visually communicate with friends, family, coworkers, or just about anyone through Skype. Now, I'll be demonstrating the Windows version of Skype, but it's also available in many other platforms, including Mac, Android, and iOS devices. Skype allows you to video chat with just about anyone around the world in near real time depending on your internet connection. And best of all, it's free. Signing up for Skype is real easy. All you have to do is go to Skype.com. Click Join Skype. Enter your basic information. Type in your desired Skype name, which is your Skype username or call sign or handle or screen name or alias or secret agent code name whatever you're into enter a password twice prove that you're not a robot and click continue you'll then be able to download Skype Click No Thanks, I'd like to download. Then click the download button. Now would be the time to make sure your webcam is plugged in. If your webcam is built into your computer, you should be good to go. You might also want to take this time to optimize your appearance. Once Skype is downloaded, just install it. Then sign in with the secret agent code name and password you created earlier. At this point, you may see the welcome screen. If not, Skype will prompt you to set your profile picture. You can either choose a picture file already on your computer or take a new one from your webcam. Aren't you glad you optimized your appearance earlier? Now when you're done, click Save. Then go to Tools, Options. Click Audio Settings and make sure you have the correct audio input source selected. If you're using a webcam, make sure that's selected. Then just click the Save button and you're ready to video chat. To find friends on Skype, click the Find Friends on Skype button. You can import your contacts from pretty much any account you might have, such as Facebook, Hotmail, Gmail, MSN, or any number of others. If you want to add a contact directly, click Add a Contact. You can find them by their email address, phone number, name, or Skype username. Once they confirm your request to add them, their online status will show on the left. If they're online, just click the video call button and you're on your way. Happy Skyping! If you have any training suggestions, ideas, comments, or questions, I'd love to hear from you. So go ahead and send me an email at training at mycomputerworks.com. You can also subscribe to our YouTube video channel by clicking the subscribe button above any one of our YouTube videos. Also, feel free to check out my blog by going to mycomputerworks.com forward slash Bowerblog or just click the link on our homepage. You can even find us on Facebook and Twitter by clicking the links in the More Info section just below this video. If you have any questions about My Computer Works or would like to know more information about our services, go ahead and give us a call at the number you see below or just visit us online at mycomputerworks.com. My name is Matt Bauer. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.